Marissa, you guys able to pick up the win tonight over Underwood? Just kind of tell me about tonight's win. Um, it was a big game just because, like, the past couple of years, we've always been beaten by Underwood. It's always been a rival, and it was really cool to see the team work together. And it was really even throughout the team, so it was cool to see. Talking about your night offensively, uh, 13 points. So what was working for you? Um, I don't know. I think my coach has been really working on me with my shot, and my team has really been there for me, working especially I've been sick all week and they've been really helping me and motivating me to come back. What's it mean for you guys to snap a two-game skid with a win? Oh, it's a big week for us. We're really proud of like how our season has been going so far. We're working as a team. Will you guys able to pick up the win tonight? Uh, how's it feel and what was the secret tonight? You know, well, we've been losing to Underwood for the last couple of years here, so it was a really big night for us and we knew we had to come out strong for it. So that was really great. Tell me about your night, 15 points, you led all scores, and it seemed like kind of your secret was to get to the free throw line. Was that something you kind of planned on going in, or was it something you were able to expose? Okay. Um, you know, they told us that tonight, if we were going to score, we had to drive, because they were really good at pressuring us on the outside. So that was just kind of key for me, and just trying to get inside, and I just happened to get to the free throw line, and making free throws really helped out then. Handful of steals on the night as well. I think I had you for six. Uh, what were you seeing defensively that was allowing you to get opportunistic? Um, you know, when you're playing defense, you just want to really look at their eyes and like where their a body is like aiming for, and then just deciding where you want to cheat to or where you want to lay off on. Anything you guys feel like you need to work on going forward? You know, there's always stuff you can work on: shooting, defense, pressing, honestly, everything. Coach, you guys are able to get that elusive win over Underwood. Uh, how's it feel? Uh, it feels really good. This was a win that you know we've been talking about all week. This was a big week for us, and we lost to Avoca on Tuesday night. So this was one that we really needed. It's always been a, a big rival. It was kind of a, a choppy game with a lot of fouls. Do you feel like maybe that, that dictated any rhythm or that kind of affect what you guys wanted to do? Oh, a little bit. Um, I knew there was probably going to be a lot of fouls, though. I mean, I told my girls that we wanted to pressure them, um, and then we also wanted to really attack them off the dribble. Um, but, yeah, we definitely need to work on moving our feet. Defensively, you guys forced a lot of turnovers tonight. I know Lily had six steals. Uh, what did you see from your defense that you liked? Uh, I was really happy with the uh, press that we put in. Um, and I told them we wanted to put pressure on, so we ended up forcing 20 steals. But the downside of that, we had 20 turnovers ourselves. So things to work on. You guys had three scores and double figures and a couple others that contributed and were close to that. Oh, what's to say about your team? Uh, I think that's just the great thing about this team is we don't have one single person that's our star. We have people that are going to step up every single night. Um, tonight, you know, our sophomore Madison Osmore stepped up, I think, with nine to have three seniors and double figures. And But even if they didn't score, we just have people that do things, get deflections and steals that just make this team a lot of fun. Looking ahead, uh, we're going to get into kind of the, the meat of the Western Iowa Conference schedule. Uh, what do you want to see from your team going forward? I just want to continue to see them to um, work hard and hustle. Uh, again, we have to take care of the basketball and move our feet, but just enjoying every opportunity that they get to play this game and to be together.